hello my beautiful people welcome to my channel my name is jenny and i want to say welcome to the reading for the sign of leo thank you to my old subscribers thank you to my new subscribers for subscribe to my channel um listen to my videos and watch my videos we're going to start the reading with the angel yvonne and it says you have a special bond with your animals your pets on earth and in heaven are watched over by angels yes my beautiful if you have a pet that it passed away if you have a pet that you still have that you have at home just know that that pet is being washing over by angels and let's go ahead and get started let's do the oracles of the island of time and wellness and i just want to invite you to subscribe even a like and comment for you can participate in the giveaway of a tarot card deck and uh stay towards the end because i do an interactive reading when i answer two of your questions towards the end of this reading so this is wonderful it's talking about a person or a relationship where it's not communication in this moment this person or you are, avo are, are avoiding a call a conversation uh you know that person doesn't want to get hurt or you don't want to get hurt that person wants to put boundaries in the relationship or you want to put boundaries in the relationship this person is still angry with you it is a separation it's an energy of right now the relationship being like hot and cold it is an energy of separation but if you see what is coming towards the relationship you have a possible meeting or conversation that is due to happen with this person and definitely we're talking about right now a, a love from the past someone from the past that is coming towards you this is no this is no a new love okay because you have the car of no today uh this person have feelings towards you and they, they say you know they like you they want a romance with you they want to be with you they want to date you again and they see you as their soulmate they want to have um they want to move with you they Thing, like they have a, that soul connection with you they think that you are their eternal love and they want to come back to you my lovely Leos okay this is the first energy for the reading and now we're gonna go ahead and see what the tarot have to tell us about this wonderful relationship that is happening here it doesn't mean that right now it is a good relationship as it is right now because I see the energy of separation I see the energy of the relationship being like hot and cold but let's see what else is coming towards my leos and we'll see energies for the sign of leo energies for the sign of leo okay energies for the sign of leo let's see Let's see what else is coming. Oh my goodness. And you got the card of the lovers, my Leo. That was the first card that I came. This is amazing, my Leos. Gemini energy in this reading. I just, I, I was trying to count the readings. And I just noticed that I just, I did a reading for Gemini. And I paused to download the reading. And I just accident, accidentally, I thought it, the reading was already downloaded. So accidentally, I erased the reading. So I thought I wanted, oh my God, I'm just gonna have to do the reading for Gemini again. Oh my goodness, this is amazing, my Leos. This love that is coming towards you, it is a love that you've just been wishing for a while. You've been wanting this person to come towards you for a while. You've been meditating about this person's energy. You've been trying to manifest this person in your life and it's finally coming towards you. This person can be from the sign of Gemini, but this person also can be uh, air sign Libra. Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Or this person can be from the sign of Virgo, earth sign, Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. Uh, but it can be all the signs because, you know, it can be you know, like a lunar sign, the moon sign, and, you know, 
it's just it depends okay so my lovelies it is talking about someone that you just want to manifest in your life someone that you want back in your life and this person is for the majority of you is someone that is coming back to your life now in the present in the present um energy my lovely you have you have the end of a difficult situation with the Ten of Swords. The Ten of Swords is, is about something that it was giving you trouble, someone that it was really stressful for you, that is finally over. It's a complete uh, the completion of a um, painful cycle, the end of a difficult situation. And you have the five, the five of Swords. The Five of Swords sometimes it represents um, like an abusive relationship, but in this case, this five of swords is representing a situation where you don't even going to believe that you're going to be winning, okay? Um, it's something that is going to happen in your life or something that you've just been waiting for a while that you're going to get this energy that you just, uh, you finally achieve something. You finally got something, you know? It is, I don't know how to explain it. It's like a, you just been waiting for something and it finally happens to uh, to you. You have also Sagittarius energy in here. My Leos, you finally gain your balance. A person that been thinking about you constantly and you finally feel like you have the balance in your life. You finally feel like this person you been wishing, you been thinking about it. This, this person is finally coming back to your life. And uh, and it's also here the energy, the living a situation that doesn't longer serve you behind. Moving for turbulence water to more peaceful waters with this Ten of Swords also, it represents almost the same as the Six of Swords. You move into more quiet and calm water. It can be that this person that is coming towards you, it can be financially stable. So your uh, money struggles going to be gone. And you also have here the two of pentacles, making a decision between two things. For some of you, I see you my Leos with more uh, suitors coming towards you. So you're gonna have to be making a decision. Who do you want in your life? Who will be the best person for my Leos? Let's see what the oracles of the, the Romans oracles have to tell us to my Leos. We're just gonna try to look, yes, the first, the first card. Let's see if we can get like two or one, one more, one more. We can do one more, Ooh, one more. Okay, excellent. And it said reflection, give each other some space at the moment. Trust and have faith that all will work out for the best. What I saw in the beginning of the reading with this specific reading, for the majority of you with this person, you are now in separation. You are in relationship that is hard and cold. And you just have to give each other a time. You know, sometimes it's like, um, it's really hard to wait for a person to call. It's really hard to wait to a person to come back. But uh, people can find love, you know, in the time that they wait. More men's, men's, um, men's when they are in the distance, they tend to value you more and they tend to discover that they really love you when they are separated and away from you. So it's telling you, the tarot is telling you, just give each other a space, just give you, each other the distance that you guys need for you guys can reevaluate the situation, reevaluate re the relationship and you guys can know what you guys really want sacred union honor and treasure your relationship for it is truly sacred and what else look deep within your heart you will feel my love my love for you is as deep as the ocean i see this person even when this person you guys are not in that communication right now because that was the first card that i came to you no communication no today no in this moment we are not communicating even when that person is your soulmate with the lover's card they are telling you that they have feelings towards you they have really strong feelings towards you but you have to be patient my leo sometimes 
Leos, we don't have no patience. We are no patient signs. We just don't have no patience. They are telling you to be patient, to wait, because this person is going to manifest himself or herself back in your life. But you have to give each other the space that you guys need for you guys can figure it out what it was wrong in the relationship. And when you guys come back, you guys can have a, even a stronger relationship than it was before. Um, my love list for the sign of Leo. Let's see. Okay, I do an interactive reading, but before that we do the interactive reading, let's see what the oracles of the Romans have to tell us. And then we're going to close with uh, three questions towards the end of the reading. Okay, this relationship can be affected by religious factor uh, and it also can be that you guys are extremely extremely different like uh, you just guys grow in like totally different um family size you guys have totally different values but it's asking you to trust trust the situation trust this situation is calling you to have faith and this situation can be affected by children okay um the relationship it, maybe you had children he had children you both had children and it's a time to retreat the disconnect from the world so it's telling you to retreat to disconnect with a special person is the possibility of travel with that person going in a trip with a special person so this is the time that i answer oh before this sorry i just keep forgetting about it this is my first reading of the day so i'm like i'm a little lost right now so before that I do uh, the answering of the question, the interactive reading, I don't know if I told you in the beginning of the reading that I do an interactive reading. I answered three of your questions towards the end of the reading, but before that I do that, I want to get the message from the animal, the, the uh, uh, spirit of the animals. I love these cards because they have such a wonderful message how to live your life. And what things do you need to learn for you can make more progress in your life, you can make more progress in your energy, you can make more progress in the things that you want, you know, in life and how to live life properly too. Okay, so here is the card is the bad spirit. It says rebirth is assured. So it's a situation that is going to rebirth. A situation or a relationship that you thought it was dead, that is finally And I'm back. Sorry, I had to stop the video because my daughter came to my room. Okay, so the spirit of the bath is co it's coming to remind you there's something. Okay, if when something ends, something is going to rebirth. Something is after something is ended, something new is gonna come. And it's like a, from the day and night, you know, uh, when the night come, you know, it's the end of the day, it's the night time. That's the time when the bat come out, okay? So it's telling you, um, even when something already ended, it is a possibility that something can be rebirth or something can start new. So be prepared for that, my Leos. Be prepared for the new things that are coming in your life. Be prepared for something that is going to be reborn, Okay, my lovely, this is the time that I answered three of your questions with the interactive reading. So I'm going to put three cards for three questions. Okay, card number one or question number one. Card number two or question number two. Card number three or question number three. You are welcome to stop the video. To, for you can pick the card that you want, for you can focus your energy on the card or, or on the reading. Okay, and then I'm just going to do card number one. Card number one, don't stop. Okay, it is a maybe, or it's a yes, don't stop. Don't stop right now, okay? I say yes, but it's gonna come in perfect timing, okay? The time of God is gonna be perfect. And it's, it, this is a no, 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 no. My beautiful people from the sign of Leo, I want to say thank you guys for staying in my video. Thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for staying towards the end of the video. I love you guys so much. You guys take care. Bye-bye.